What up YouTube, Mark Films back again with another video. And uh, for today's video, this is actually gonna be a Christmas video. Um, I've seen this plenty of times on Instagram and I was like, wow, I have to do that. And it's a free excuse uh, to upload a video out to you guys. And I've been loving all the support, uh, the comments just keep me going and the feedback. And uh, I truly believe that I think I'm making every video better than the previous video. So um, I, I look forward to editing this and getting it, getting this out before Christmas for sure. Stop and, the cat. Uh, Merry Christmas to you guys. I have 600 lights um, right behind me. I hope that's enough. They're uh, multicolored lights, so it's gonna be like every color. And I'm just gonna be taping them on uh, to the truck. And uh, I'm gonna be having my friend Alex pull up here shortly and he's gonna help me out with that. Uh, and then there's gonna be a car meet tonight in Sacramento area. So. You know, we're gonna try to make it out there with all the Christmas lights on the vehicle. Hopefully uh, they stick on. And uh, I hope this video turns out cool and fun. We got the new mic as well, so the audio is way better. Um, on the previous video, go check it out if you haven't yet. That was a Starlight Headliner install. And uh, I, didn't, I didn't use the microphone, but I did get it as uh, shown, but stay tuned. Uh, make sure you drop a like and subscribe and uh, let's have fun, uh, fun and enjoy this process. All right, guys, um, I'm heading back home. Um, I hope the audio is good because with the truck being cammed, it's super loud or like hard to understand in here. I always record there. I don't know if you guys have noticed that, but I will be getting the truck tuned uh, today, Saturday, Christmas Eve is on Sunday, and then Monday you got Christmas. And then um, on Tuesday, I'm actually gonna be heading over with uh, Peak Torque Innovations. And we're gonna be getting the truck tuned on Flex Fuel. And uh, the truck right now is just is running really good, but it's running like on a just like on a base tune, you know, just running. We just want it running right, and we're gonna try to get everything we can out of it. Ooh, we're gonna try to get everything we can out of it uh, on Tuesday. So stay tuned for for that. I'm for sure not gonna upload this video before Tuesday, so I might get some content. I might get some content there. Oh just past the police officer. All good. Um, but yeah, stay tuned for that. Uh, I'm really excited to look forward to that with the truck running really good. And you know, we're gonna get it on uh, that flex fuel. And uh, 2024 is coming up. I've accomplished uh, mainly everything I wanted to accomplish this year, uh, besides getting merch out to you guys and getting more decals out. Um, with Endless Visions, of course, and just getting the brand running. And uh, I have been growing the Instagram slowly, but surely the TikTok uh, is doing really good as well. Um, but yeah, 2024, for sure, that's gonna be my main goal. And uh, I hope you guys have a great year and accomplish the things you guys wanna get done. You know, um, don't, wait for, don't wait for the new year though. That's the thing, you know, everyone always waits. Uh, uh, to New Year's and they say, all right, New Year, new me. You know, that, that it's, you know, you gotta start now. You just gotta start now. And um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to get the ball rolling with Endless Visions and decals and merchandise, uh, trust me. Um, but yeah, 2024, that's gonna be my main priority and YouTube, I'm gonna uh, give it more, more of my time and energy and, uh, you know, just try to get, oh, just try to get that going. And I did get a pretty badass tripod. I got a tripod and uh, it's like a selfie stick stabilizer. And it came with like the phone mount and I connected it to like my GoPro setup too. So I'm recording on my phone, which has better quality than the GoPro, but I don't want to keep yapping. Um, I just want to show you guys the GoPro and I did want to talk to you guys about the tune I'm getting on Tuesday. And uh, I wanted to talk to you guys about 2024 and make sure, I hope you guys have a good year. Don't let the bad things uh, like define you or you know stop you from doing what you want to do. And uh, let's get into this video. I'm on my way home and we're gonna get straight to work and installing these uh, Christmas lights. All right, guys. So right now I went I went to Walmart and I went to go buy an adapter and then I got the lights and I got everything set up. I actually ended up going to the gym before as well because uh, my friend Alex uh, was working and he was gonna come later. He should be here any minute now, but I'm gonna go ahead and get started. I got 600 lights and I'm just gonna start going. We got power, I turned them on and uh, they're uh, very colorful. So that's badass. 
and now I'm just gonna with clear tape I'm just gonna be that's how I'm gonna that's what I'm gonna use to have them stick together and uh, let's see if we have enough lights to go all around the truck what do you guys think you guys think 600 will be enough but I'm gonna get started um, I'll be recording as I go as well but I just kind of wanted to get an intro going all right guys, so we've worked our way from the driver's side door all the way to the front end and we ran out of our th first 300. So I don't know if we'll be able to make it all around because we still need the bed on the driver's side right here, but we'll for sure be able to finish the whole passenger side. And I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on so we could get a better idea. Ooh, I heard that tape coming off. I did get an option where it comes with this box where I could push this button and switch them over but the colorful one is the more popular option oh it did come off the hand now opening the door i think it looks good at night it's for sure gonna be popping i'm looking forward to it damn this is pretty sick it looks good on camera too and it's still daytime so i could i could only imagine how it's gonna look in the nighttime yeah, so that's all the lights we have left. But it's looking good so far. So we started at three o'clock. Um, it's like 3.50 and we're almost done. We still need the, the rear end and the, the bed on the driver's side. So within an hour, we'll, we have done 700 lights, which is pretty badass. There's uh, the car meet later tonight at seven. Uh, sun will be down by then, we'll be in the Sacramento area. So we'll for sure get some content at the event. All right guys, uh, we went to the car show, but I didn't get any, I didn't film at all. Mm. Bruh. There wasn't much to film, but Alex and I, we did end up leaving the event early and we went to downtown Sacramento and we just got some videos for Instagram. So stay tuned for that. But yeah, we got plenty of videos. The truck looks super cool at night. It looks super cool at night. Um, if you guys, I, I will add some content to this video, but a lot will be on Instagram for sure. So I'll put the Instagram right here. If you guys haven't followed yet, but make sure you go follow and the TikTok as well right here. And then uh, follow the TikTok as well. I'll be posting the truck on that. And uh, I had a great time today. Uh, thanks uh, to Alex for helping me. We did it really fast. We did it in like an hour. And um, yeah, it was super fast. We have 700 lights on. Next year, we're for sure gonna do more. We'll try to get the, the, the roof. And then we'll get Alex's truck as well. And even Manny. Manny's in Mexico, so he's not here. Um, but yeah, next year for sure, stay tuned. and. Um, yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying the video. No vuelvo para atrás para la pobreza y aunque muchos lo quisieran, el gusto no les va a dar. Razones de amontones me sobran y son las que me motivan para el tren nunca parar. Yo siempre en sus manos me sostiene, le agradezco lo que viene y lo que tuvo que pasar. All right, what's up, guys? This is a whole new new site for you guys um i'm probably gonna add this to the christmas video with new year's it's currently december 30th um today i'm gonna have one last photo shoot and get more content of the truck with the christmas lights before i take them off and it's my mom's birthday and i just wanted to pick up the camera because i just left safeway and i got a bunch of flowers so i got the, i forgot what all of these are called i'm no professional of course but like the, I just kind of wanted to show you guys this and I just wanted to just kind of say like if you have a girlfriend or if you have sisters or a mom you get her some flowers you do not have to go all out like this I'm gonna make a bouquet I don't even know what I'm doing I just really like the colors I'm gonna put them together something different I always uh, buy my mom some flowers for her birthday and I wanted to do something new this year um, but yeah, dude, like flowers are super cheap. Like these were like 13 bucks. 
So like even this would have just been girls love flowers. This would have just small details is what I'm telling you guys. But watch me cook, watch me go in the lab. I don't want to talk too much. I just kind of wanted to give you guys a little bit of a different scenery from the trucks. <sighs> Let's have fun with this, right? So I'm just going to start putting flowers together. Oh, fuck. This might be a little harder than I thought, huh? Honestly, I think the best way to do this is having it sit down. After this, I'm probably gonna hit the gym. This morning, I did get the truck tuned. Um, I didn't record it, but we did get the truck tuned and we got it on flex fuel now. Um, the truck is running great. It's not running 100%. I did order a, um, I went ahead and I ordered a, uh, a new fuel pump because that's what was holding us back. So I got a new fuel pump on the way. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm not used to talking with this microphone, but I'm finished. Uh, hopefully it comes out good. I have two pieces left over. I don't want to add them. Those will go to my sister. But now you'd like wrap it around with uh, a paper, but I'm just gonna use this paper. And uh, I put one, I put one Liga around it. Let's rip off the price tag because you can't put a price on, on love. What do you guys think? Drop a like for this right now. I'm gonna add this to the YouTube video. I'm big hyped. I'm looking at myself in the mirror. Drop a like for this. Moral of the story, buy your girlfriend, buy your sister, buy your mom some flowers, buy someone you love some flowers because they are underrated. And this was fun, it was kind of stressful, but dude, do it. You know, just 2024, our year, all right? How about that? Happy New Year, happy Christmas. I'm probably gonna fix this off camera. <laughs> um, I'm pretty happy, I'm pretty happy, but yeah. That's about it for this segment. And let's get back into the truck action. All right guys, so we got most of the paint off, but we do have some bad news. The tape was a really strong tape and we did have the paint peel off. So you guys can see right here, I peeled off some of the clear coat on that paint job. I might just, um, I might just uh, paint the door again, honestly. All right guys, so I just finished peeling off the tape. Oh, nope, I see a little bit more down there. But learn from my mistakes. We got paint peel right there. We got some paint peel right here. I should have used painter's tape, like the blue or the yellow. So if you guys are going to do this, I recommend using a yellow tape. Other than that, uh, the paint on the rest of the truck is fine. Besides the bed imperfections, the door, I might get the door painted. You got this one on the door, you got this one on the door, and I believe there's another one. And you got this one on the door. Might get the door painted, and uh, the hood is fine, the bumper's fine. But do you guys see it? The grill. I am pissed. I am pissed. Of course, I was gonna have.